Well, this is what it's going to come down to here. Who is the true holder of the DDT? Jonathan Darwin joined by Simon Rothschild. Oh. As I was saying, Jonathan Darwin joined by Simon Rothschild here at International Combat Sports 33 Fight Night. Well, Mayhem, I tell you what, he's been on quite a tear lately. He beat Smokey C at International Combat Sport 31. And it, it, he's claimed since Bruce Gray's been gone that Mayhem has rightful claim to the DDT. Well, Jonathan Darwin, I think that either one of these men can apply that hold from several different vantage points and score a pinfall. It's going to come down to who might be the most resourceful in this match. That's a great way to say it. I can't believe I'm saying that, Simon, but that's a good analysis of this one. You're welcome, Jonathan Darwin. And be a little bit of the aggression there. Mayhem comes in now, thanks to Bruce Gray. This may be your case, common case of youth versus experience. Experience on the side of Gray, youth and, and full of vigor on the side of Mayhem. And right now it looks like Gray's getting the better of him. Yeah, Mayhem getting beat around there, goes off the ropes and gets caught in a back body drop to Mayhem. Mm. Uh, Bruce still not 100% as you can see out there. Well, if I were Mayhem, I know for one, I would have coached him up and been like, target the shoulders, both of them. Which, which makes logical sense in this case. That is Bruce Gray now. What in the... Oh, my Lanta. Oh, my. Oh, that's a different way to run the head into the canvas. Mm. Going for the pin here. I tell you what, Simon, I was surprised to see a pin there. I figure Bruce, if anything, lost to DDT Mayhem at this point. Well, I think right now he's got a great opportunity to do that very thing. It looks like he's setting up for it, and Mayhem slips out the back door. Mayhem called for a break in the action, but there isn't really going to be one. I tell you what, Mayhem, he may have underestimated Bruce Gray in this one. Oh! The digits of mayhem getting stomped away by the mobile home wrecker as Bruce Gray comes mm. up and over and out. Right into that, right into that paying customer seat. I tell you what, that lady's gonna have a great night. Talk about a once-in-a-lifetime experience. Now Bruce Gray, it looks like he's gonna celebrate a little bit here. I think he may be celebrating a bit prematurely. Possibly. Kick to the midsection. And Bruce Gray there. Uh, see, now this is where it just gets that, yeah. Save a horse, ride a mayhem. As we see now. And here's the thing. These guys got to the count of 20 on the outside, so. That's absolutely 19 seconds too long of this. Yiddy up mayhem. I tell you, I think Bruce Gray's more about embarrassing mayhem at this point. Well, you may be right on that, but again, you can't beat your opponent at outside the ropes. It's got to be inside the square circle. No, that's where the money's made, Jonathan. Okay, but even you would agree, getting in the head of your opponent gives you a tactical advantage, one, one that's not easily taken away. Absolutely. And again, I've seen getting into the heads of some, of some people completely backfire because they're ready for it. And there is that possibility. And here's where the tables are going to turn. Mayhem on the aggression now. A oh nice my. snap suplex on the floorboards. Oh, my. Just straight down on that basketball floorboard. Uh, Mayhem now. He's not done dishing out the punishment here as he picks up. Could this be an apron? Drop! Oh, Across the spine of Bruce Gray, and probably a little damage to the shoulders there, Simon. That's where I was. You beat me by five seconds, Jonathan Darwin. And the knee beaten down Bruce Gray now. As you see, I, I, I thought it was a fish hook. I didn't get a good look at it. Uh, it looked like he was just helping Bruce Gray out there. Helping? Are you kidding me? Jeez, oh, peace. 
Shoulder rams now. In the immortal words of Jesse the Body Ventura, there's nothing like the great equalizer, like a good thumb to the eye. Well, of course, that would come from somebody like you, Simon Rothschild. Bruce Gray up and off the ropes, and oh! Beautiful backdrop. Yeah, Mayhem used that one to his advantage. Goes to the pin. Mm -hmm. Two count there. Mayhem, he needs not to get flustered, and he's doing that right now. He's staying on top of Gray. Well, they, did, they definitely have the wrong referee for this match. Jim Lawrence can't count to two, let alone three. Yes, he can. I've seen him count to three against your men many a time. <laughs> No comment. Okay. But here's what I will say about Mayhem. He's really improved and matured since the time I've been calling matches here and in and out for combat sports. Normally, Mayhem would have been frustrated, but he stayed right on top of Bruce Gray. I will agree with you there. Mayhem has gotten and has become more improved, more skilled, a little more polished. Deep frog there, and what a drop kick by the mobile home wrecker. Very nicely placed, upper shoulder area near the neck. Just as Bruce Gray intended. Yeah, Bruce Gray grabbing the small of his back, though. Trying to get a DDT off it. Oh! Wait a minute. Yeah, yeah. counter by Mayhem, counter by Gray. Fist into nobody home. And Bruce Gray looking to pepper him with jabs here. Yeah, a little stick and move being applied by Bruce Gray, but he gets caught by Mayhem. And Mayhem. Mm, across the knee, that bad shoulder. This could be it, JD. What? Two count. And unfortunately, Jim Lawrence again cannot count to three. He didn't need to count to three. Bruce Gray got his shoulder up, Simon. When he's kicking up, the shoulders are still down, Darwin. That hand needs to be coming down. Hand needs to be coming down. Okay, well, we will agree to disagree on that one. As we see Mayhem now. Oh, I'll tell you what, this is where Mayhem's really improved. He's learning to pick a pot of body part. That, and he's got a little bit of a main streak. I like it. Bruce, Bruce fighting back though. As we see here, can Bruce get it, get it going to his favor? Oh, and that hair pull just takes Gray over back on his, those damaged shoulders, Simon. Mm -hmm. And again, nobody home for the headbutt drop. Gray trying to get fired up, get a little more adrenaline. He's picking him up. Oh, oh. I don't know. I want to say it was an inverted atomic drop, but it, it's almost like he picked him up with a choke slam at first as Grace tries to get off the DDT, but is unsuccessful. Oh, wow. McMahon's got Gray up. Sit down slam. Trying to get a cover. Grabs a leg. And again, Jim Lawrence can't count to three. Unbelievable. I cannot believe how biased you can be against some people in the locker room. It's right there on the video. We're watching this live on the monitor. Look, he can't count to three. His shoulders were down. Well, we're going to see if that does happen here. Unbelievable. I'll tell you what, Mayhem, he needs to stay focused. He's getting a little angry out there. And Boy, Van Vanessa was right. You do have rose-colored glasses, Joe. No, I don't. They're clear. As we see Mayhem. Clear and terrible. And you see here, Mayhem. He's, he's agitating the fans, but that's not the way Mayhem's going to win the match. He gets caught by Bruce Gray. And. Mm, mm, I tell you. Oh, my. But a kick just like that. Oh, oh there, there it is. is. By Mayhem. There it is. Now you see he should have no problem counting to three. Now here's where we're him. Here, here's here's rookie mistakes. Yeah, go, wanting to go for the devil's horns. I tell you what, and I'm gonna. You may disagree with me, Simon, but I think this is Mayhem's undoing. He could have won that match if, if he covered Bruce Gray. I'll have to agree with you on that. As, as bad as I hate to, you're right. And, and Mayhem taking a lot, a lot of time. Of time. And, and, and arguing with the fans is not gonna win you a match. If Mayhem can stay. Laser focused on Bruce Gray and, uh, and did not. And now Mayhem's going to pay for it. He's going to come in the hard way. Getting tossed around like a rag doll. Bruce Gray getting that second win. Yeah, Mayhem really is paying the penalty now. Oh, my. Nice knee lift. Knee, knee strike. Oh, what a super kick. 
And, and Bruce wants to get it off. And off comes the shoulder of Harness that was protecting his shoulders and keeping him there. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. What's Jack Sharp? Jack Sharp making an appearance. Oh, saving his dear friend Mayhem. Yeah, from losing. Not going to give. Let's see what happens. Here. Hey, there. Lawrence got the three. Shocker. But we got to go all the way to 20. We're only halfway there now, and Gray frustrated. And can you blame him? But here goes Mayhem. Mayhem coming back for more. Mayhem better be careful. He's going to get counted out. No, no. This is actually brilliant on Mayhem's part. It's a count out on purpose. Look at the disdain and the bad taste it left in the mouth of Bruce Gray. Yeah, Bruce Gray's going to want to get his hands on Mayhem down the line. That is for certain. 